gonna be better. It's the guys that got here. This is the worst intro ever. Alright, basically, you can see everywhere. I'm going to be showing you all of my stuffed animals. Oops, wrong camera. Not even a thing. But yeah, so, what I've done is I've already put them in groups, kind of. So I have a Plants vs. Zombies group, not that big. A Minecraft group, and a Angry Birds group. Mostly space. And just a random group. Like, of ones that I couldn't really make a group out of. Alright, so first, we're going to be looking at Plants vs. Zombies. And then, his pants came off. Alright, so up first we got a hypno zombie or hypnotized zombie. And, uh, just a reg, he's just a basic, he's just a regular zombie, tinted purple. So, yeah. I don't know where to put these on, though. I'm just gonna lay them here. I don't know. Alright, next we have a pea shooter. And, oh, his eyes are apart. I didn't even notice that. But yeah, he's the basic pea shooter. So, uh, just a pea shooter. That's about it. And then, we got a conehead zombie. And I always wondered why his face was like this, instead of like a basic zombie. i put it here, I guess, if I can try. I'm not sure. But, and then, I asked someone, and they were like, oh yeah, I think it's to make him more unique. So, because like, collectors might feel like they're getting ripped off or something. So yeah, it's pretty cool. Makes him more unique. He looks weird in the camera like this. Cause his eyes. <laughs> All right, that's about it for the Plants vs Zombies series. I'm gonna be trying to expand those, making like customs and all that stuff. I think we'll save these for last. All right. So going on to the random section. Oh. We have a, I don't even know what he, what he is. He's like a settler or something like that. I don't know. We got him in Jamestown. So, yeah. I mainly chose him out just because how like flexible he is. He has like bendable knees. I just like him because you, you can like drop him. Ah! Oh, and he lands in whatever pose he wants. Alright, now, I guess next, we have Finn from, uh, crap, oh my gosh, I forgot it. I was about to say Finn and Jade, but that's not the name, it's Adventure Time. So, here's a backpack, I'm not sure if you can take it off, no, you can't, because it's sewed in. I have a random scratch here. Here's his backpack. That's about it, just Finn. Alright, next, I guess, I'm just going to be going randomly. So I have a, oh, he's big. So I have a Kylo Ren, uh, Build-A-Bear, actually. It comes with a little lightsaber, it actually, wait. Pretty cool. Here's the hood, can't really take it off. You can only go like that, which kind of looks a little weird. I like to keep him with that on. And he has a little cape on the back, part of his hood. And he actually says a couple quotes, so I might, I'm not sure if I'd get copyrighted for this. What? Oh. Hopefully it's not too staticky on camera. So yeah, he's pretty cool. This guy, I think I won him, or not even I won him, I think my sister won him in a, a claw machine. Yeah. So. He might be appearing in videos. <laughs> Next we have this thing. Uh, it's a, you can't really read it, but it's a Hershey Park, um, it's a Hershey Park, like, for in Tennessee. Um, but yeah, it's just a donut from there. A little souvenir. Now we'll be moving on to one of my favorites. I've had him for a while now. And I didn't actually win this in a claw machine. Yeah, he's won from a claw machine. 
but I didn't actually win him. Uh, my brother's friend did actually. I was just I was real little, and he just like grabbed and I was like, I didn't even know you could win them. And then, yeah, I've had him for a while. He had a little torn arm here. I think the dog got him or something. I'll show him up on it uh, later. Oh, now you his broken arm. Next, yeah, Claptrap from Borderlands. Which, and this guy's actually pretty cool because he, look, you see this? He actually has a moving wheel. You can't really roll it on or anything, but yeah, you can move it if you want to do so for any reason. Little, like, pretty thin arms. I'm not sure what they're made out of. Kind of like, not really styrofoam -y, it's weird. Yeah, little flaps, an antenna. Overall, pretty cool claptrap. Next, we have this bear, which I'm, he's probably gonna definitely, he's definitely gonna appear in a, an episode of my channel, I'm not sure. So, as you can see, he has a collar here. I'm not even, I'm not sure if it's supposed to be connected to something, or it's just supposed to be like, walking a pet bear. But yeah, it's, you can't really read it. I'll try to split the image if I can. But Great Smoky Mountains. But yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Next. Oh, we got this from a loot crate. I think it was just one of the random loot crates. But yeah, little tiny Godzilla. I might make him like the son of Godzilla. He has like spikes in his back. Kind of remind me of a certain candy. I don't remember. So, yeah, he's pretty cool. Chubby. But cool. He could be like the overweight son of Godzilla. Alright, so this guy. Uh, Yankees, just a Yankees mascot. We got him at one of the game ball games. He's pretty cool. Little cow. Okay. Cause he's a cow. Next, I'm not sure if this guy counts as a stuffed animal. So he looks like a stuffed animal until you see the bottom, and then you're like, wait, what does he do? So stop it! Why do you have to ring, Fergie? Fergie! Fergie! Stop ringing! All right, so if you see that. Bergie, stop it. Stop it. What are you doing? Stop ringing. I think you that bell to annoy me during videos. Stay there for a second. Oh, yes. I was at this guy. Alright, so, if you pay attention. Hello. Hold on. Subscribe to the Sarcastic Cat on YouTube. I gotta say it a little bit louder. Subscribe to the cart. Subscribe to the Sarcastic Cat on YouTube. Basically, it just repeats it in a higher voice. Yeah, I got this as a gift from somebody. The mechanical noise of him moving actually over, over, like, does the voice, which. I don't know why. Next is this. He's actually a condor, which is a type of bird. I'll probably put a picture. Oh, gosh. But yeah, we went to Peru earlier. Um, and yeah, we got him at like one of the last days of Peru. He's pretty cool. He might appear in videos. Uh, he might be a bad guy, since I think he's like a type of vulture. I'm not sure. I'll look it up. Next is this guy. He appeared in, uh, I think it was called Plush Gang. He actually doesn't come with this jacket. He actually came with, like, a shirt that said, like, I Heart California or Florida. Yeah. Florida. And I got him there, yeah. Got him from Florida. It was just this little souvenir. It was a while back. But yeah, I got him there. Put a little jacket on him. I think this is one of my sister's doll's jacket, but I thought it looked cool on him. And he also... Yeah, I'm surprised he actually still does that. Most uh, stuffed animals lose their static or their voice. Got one of these. He's actually an angry teddy bear. He will be appearing in the Plants of Zombies series. I'm not gonna tell you why. He's actually in the next episode, but no spoilers. No spoilers. The reason I got him. So uh, these guys are actually connected. So we were in a, we were at an auction, and um, I was like, oh. I looked over and I was like, oh, I just saw this. And I was like, that's a golden bunny. He uh, he, was, he looks real cool. He caught my eye because he was gold. So I walked over there. And my mom was like, oh, they're only $2 a piece. Do you want to get like another or two? 
So it's like, uh, sure, bow. Basically just a bunny with gold. Pretty cool, actually. So, what? and I was searching. I saw this bear, and I was like, oh, might as well flip them over. Took a pow, and then I was like, oh, crap. He's mad. And we're nearing the end of this, the random ones. So we have Mickey Mouse. I don't know why I started on that. But yeah, I've had him for a while now. Gloves with little, like, three things on it. I've always worn my gloves like that. He might appear in the series. I'm trying to make a series, not currently right now, but I'm thinking of making a series where it's kind of like a game show. But I feel like that'd be copying someone, which, uh, I don't really feel like copying them. I watch them a lot, that's their inspiration. But I'm not sure, I'd have to figure out a way to make it diff sim different. This guy, he, I'm not sure if he counts as a plush because he's hard. Moves his ears when he's oh, So, I guess we'll be moving on to the Angry Birds space. I don't have any normal Angry Birds. So here, we got Red. I think that's his name. He might have a different name. I think it's Red, though. Just gonna turn this guy off. Freak, done freaked me out. I was sitting there. And then he was just like, Pikachu. And I was like, dang, I scared. He's actually, uh, has a little face mask thing. Glowing eyes, little tail. I'm not sure if that's a, supposed to be like a mouth or something, but there's like something there, like stitch marks. I'm not sure if it's supposed to be his mouth or something. It is oh yeah, by the way, I was in the store, and I think it was my birthday or something. We were in the Angry Birds aisle, so we got to pick out Angry Birds stuff. I got a pillow, I think it's in the wash now, but it's like Angry Birds space pillow. I'll put it up on camera now. And I also got this guy in red. So yeah, he's a little symbol on him, on him little flame, like a little torch thing, and Saturn rings, wait, anyways, yeah, he's pretty cool, here is Chuck, Space Chuck, this is probably one of the coolest ones, cause he's like purple, got this little cool, oh, this little cool thing, oh man, I haven't been looking at, camera the, uh, at the camera the entire time, I'm, I think it's fine, pretty cool eyebrows, he's like, um, I just look like a guy that lost his cigarette. And he has a visor, which is really cool. I that was my bird bang. I mean, I was gunshots outside. Ran out of bullets. Okay, but I know some of them do. Oh, yeah, he does. Look at that. little badge, I think, or something to hold it. That was sick. He has like these little icicles, like, they should be icicles, but I think they're feathers made of ice. But yeah, again, he has the same thing right there, little, the little flap, like it's supposed to, you're supposed to cut it out or something, I'm not sure. Yeah. Oh, he has one too. Oh, I think it's broke. I think it was like in the water or something. Do perfect 2020. The last guy is Terrence. And I just, so he's not in the right proportions because he's almost almost smaller than this, almost smaller than this guy. Even though he's supposed to be the big bird, but he's, nonetheless, he's still pretty cool. God. All right, now moving to now finishing up, we have Minecraft. So starting off, we have the Endermen, and as you and as you probably know, if you're like a plush collector or something, his eyes aren't purple like they're supposed to be, even though mine is. But if you always look them up, they're always white. I'm like, that doesn't look like the game. Even if they're full purple, he has still has pupils. So I got a random purple marker and drew eyes on him. It was a wild night. And another. He's, he's, I like him because he's like noodle arms. It allows for a lot of flexibility, unlike the zombie. Okay. Oh, he's downstairs from where I was filming. <laughs> but, yeah, look. Little noodle arms. Allows for a lot of flexibility. He's one of the classics I had him since for a while. 
One of the first ones I think I had. Also, skeleton. Now, I might make a bow for him. But yeah, he has like little... He has relatively flappy arms like that. So, him and the Enderman have been buddies ever since I was little. That's what I do. That's what I thought at least. Also, something cool. Now he's a thin head, and if you do this, he's a flat head. Very squishable head. And you just beat him a little bit. Hopefully, you don't go to jail for abuse. He looks normal again. Yay! We have the chicken. I actually got this like. Ooh, last two years ago, 2018 Christmas, I think. Bergy, can you stop ringing, please? Bergy! Ah, Bergy! Stop it! Stop it! Chill out, Bergy! Bergy, I'm trying to film. Bergy, Bergy, I'm trying to film. Don't make me take that bell away. So, little flappy arms. And if you didn't know, they don't have pitch black eyes. They're like all the other animals where they have like white here and black here, like their eyes are supposed to be looking apart, no, but yeah. He actually has those, I actually got that from Magma, a uh, Minecraft person, but yeah. <laughs> Moving on, I got this the same Christmas, a little mushroom, favorite type of animal. I don't have a full size one yet though, so. Little udders. Anyways, yeah, he has little horns too. Take some shears to him, turn him into a Anyways. Why do you look so stupid? Come on, fix your face. Creeper. As you can see right there, I actually have another one. So, uh, two people got me the same one for Christmas. But, he, this guy's softer. This guy's like a weird texture kind of, like coarse-ish. This guy's really soft. And my mom got me that one, my nana got me this one. But... You might say, oh, this one's better, because he's soft. No, 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 no. Wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. This guy, while being soft, is, he doesn't have anything to make sound, because he's a creeper, he has to explode. He's soft, definitely. So texture goes to this guy. But, something cooler about this guy, you can kind of see that he's not the same texture as that guy. Alright. Yeah, he actually makes an exploding sound, which is really cool about this guy. Also, he's taller. Which I think represents the creeper a little bit more. Because this is to be slender. Maybe, I think they have the same proportions, though. So this is the big brother, little brother, in my Minecraft series. I might post a Minecraft series, I'm not sure. But yeah, double creeper. Alright, now the finale. But yeah, look. An ender dragon. I actually got this from someone. That's about it. But, look, so he has wings. Uh, I can kinda, I'm kinda good at making the noises, I'm not sure. But yeah, like little flappy wings. Oh, flappy tail too. And he has legs popping out as if he was flying. Purple eyes. Didn't draw these on. They, they came like this. Little horns, spiny, all the way to his tail. Nice. But little nose flaps, I don't know why, but little, little, little nose flaps. But yeah, he's pretty cool. So, I think that concludes my plush connection. This guy isn't actually a plush, I just thought I would include him. What is that? What is that? What is that? They're brothers. Dude, dude. Uh, yeah, he's creepy. I got this Christmas, I got this for Christmas actually this year. Bergy! Can you chill out for a second? I didn't even notice you were on that because you all do it all the time. Thank you. Anyways. Bergy! 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 Gosh, dang it, I'm trying to record a video. But yeah. Little movable feet, movable head. So it's pretty cool.
Oh, hold on. I forgot one of them. So this is what I was talking about with uh, the... Oh, he looks weird like that. I have to flip the image. No, you don't. But yeah, look at that. He, has, he doesn't have that much bendable arms. I mean, obviously, they're made of, they're made of like, stuffing. So he doesn't have that. He has a little bit of movement, just like enough to make him punch himself. Pow! He can kick himself in the butt. Pow! Wow. He actually appeared in my Plush Gangs episode, as did the skeleton, and me. I didn't know if you guys knew I was in it. I, was, I played a very minor character. It's like, I'm actually an Easter egg. Tell me if you can find me in that video. Comment it down below. That'd be pretty cool. But yeah, him. Just a zombie. Basic. Looks like Steve. So that's it. Alright. So this video turned out to be a little bit long. Not really, actually. I probably cut most of it out, so it'll only be like 10 minutes, hopefully. I might have spent too long looking at him. It's 20 minutes long, man. Why'd you make me edit this for so long? So thank you guys for watching. Hopefully it's not too long. Hopefully I can edit it a little bit. Yeah. But, yeah. Alright, I lose. I lost the staring contest to a bird. Anyways, this is my third time saying it, but final time, hopefully. Thank you guys for watching. Who's calling me? I li- Do You guys couldn't see it, but somebody called me. On Google Duo. This is my final time saying it. I promise. 100%. I'll delete my YouTube channel if I don't- if I say it one more time. So, thank you guys for watching. Tell me- comment down below if you want any more, uh, plush videos, cause I could expand on them. Or, like, you know, not, like, you know what I mean. Make- I can make- I can get more plushes. Birdie, stop it! I promise, I'm gonna delete my channel, please, don't tell me, please. Stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it! Alright, I guess you guys are gonna have to end the video with ringing, cause I'm not gonna delete my channel. Thank you guys for what?